Hi guys. So, I don't know if you could guess what I've bought, or what I've ordered, should I say. It's a new tank! This one's um, a four foot tank, but it's a lot taller, it's four inches taller than my other six foot tank. They almost contain the exact same amount of water. My six foot tank contains 380 litres, which is 100 gallons, just over 100 gallons. And my new tank is going to be 300, 310 litres, I think it is. I don't know how many gallons that is, guys, but it's pretty damn huge. It's a lot taller. It's four inches taller than my six inch. So, yeah, so I'm going to keep my, um, it's going to be a South America, I'm an American cichlid tank so hopefully they'll get along it's a beautiful tank like I said it's taller than the others which I kind of like so I've got my geophagus already that's gonna go in there that tank there I'm gonna sell on Gumtree I can't wait guys I should be getting it this weekend hopefully so yeah it's gonna cost about $700 but that includes everything the hood the stand the heater the pump everything It's gonna be so good. I love my fishies. So, okay, let's see. Let's go get it, guys. Hi, guys. So we're going to the aquarium manufacturer. You'll see the exact tank that I'll be buying. He makes them in his workshop. And he does a pretty good deal. I think I'll be spending $700 today for the aquarium, the aquarium stand, the aquarium hood, a heater and a um, a water filter. So I'll see you later. So this is a tank that I'll be getting minus the stand. The stand is a special one. I'll just be getting the regular stand, and the one I'll be getting will be an extra three inches wide. But as you can see, it's quite tall. Lots of space for the South American cichlids. Hi guys. So as you can see, the fish tank that I'll be buying is quite big. It's just particularly tall. It's super tall. It's 24 inches high, which is higher than any of the other tanks I've ever had. But it looks beautiful. And um, so unfortunately, I was, I was hoping to have it delivered to me today. But he said that's not the case. It's going to be about four or five days before he has the time to deliver it to me. Which sucks because I'd arranged to pick up a, uh, a beautiful Oscar named Boris. What a cool name, right? Boris the Oscar. But um, I've had to message them again saying, look, I can't pick it up because I don't have the tank yet. And I offered them $80 if they could hold it for me. So, But it's a beautiful tank. It's going to have my Geophagus as well as uh, the Oscar. And that'll be it for that tank. A bit of driftwood and that'll be it. So um, let me show you where it's going to go. Right here beneath that poster and that's quite tall I was hoping it would be as, as tall as this one I'm gonna get rid of this one by the way I've already got somebody lined up to buy it but this one's quite quite short the stand is quite short whereas with this one with my six footer the stand is like about a meter tall it's horrible I don't like it I, I don't I can't see my fish that well when I'm lying in bed here so I've got some media flowing, floating, I mean. There's another one up here, as you can see. So I'm going to have my African cichlids and I'm going to have my two beautiful American cichlids. I'm looking forward to it, guys. It's going to be beautiful. All right, well, um, I don't know what else to say, but let's get this tank in here. I'll, I'll be back when we're getting the tank installed. See you later. Okay, so here we are guys, filling up the tank. I've set up the, the canister filter. It's not running yet, but um... Yeah, so quite a stressful ordeal really, setting up a fish tank. Like I, I probably spent about two hours on it, putting the background on, cleaning the glass. What I do is I, I use a, uh, a wet chux cloth, and I wipe everything down, and then I use a dried chux cloth to um... To get rid of all the debris because these guys manufacture the stands at the same place where they do the, the uh, glass and I find that there's always bits of sawdust fine fine bits of sawdust inside the actual tank
Okie dokie, so I've got my canister filter running, as you can see, there's a stream jet there, lovely. I've got my sponge from my mature aquarium, hopefully spreading the not fine bacteria. I've got the heater on. Now, I've, I've, I waited a while before I put the heater on. Uh, sorry, bef before I put the, the media in, because I wanted to make sure the water was warm enough to not kill off the bacteria. So I waited for it to hit 20 degrees Celsius, and I've chucked them in, and I put this in as well. Now the, I'm, I'm hoping to get this tank up to 24 degrees Celsius before I add Bobo. Oh. You look so sad today. Maybe he's a bit spooked out, there's no filter in the tank or anything. Okie dokie. So I've got the geophagus in. I'm thinking of getting a noscoid in. You can't really see these fins very well, but they're, they're red. And there's bubbles on the glass because it's a new tank. But there he is. So I've done everything, all I have to do, I've got the lights up there as well, which aren't on at the moment because I don't want to spook him out too much, I won't put the lights on today and I won't feed him today. But then I've got the canopy, the hood, to go, sorry, the hood to go on. And that'll be it, my tank will be set up. All I need is another Oscar, oh yeah. Now this guy, he rang me up yesterday before delivering, he's like, look, I'm really sorry, but um, the stand I have for you is 10, 10 inches, sorry, 10 centimeters shorter than it's meant to be and I'm man that's sweet I really wanted it shorter anyway it should be an extra 10 centimeters taller and that's just too tall like anyway it turned out perfect so and the canister turned out well as well so yeah okie dokie here's my new tank set up guys I've got the filter in set up I've got the filter in I've got the heater and of course there's geophagus and the cat hey Amy What a beautiful specimen. So I've got somebody moving in with him next week. Stay tuned to this channel to watch who his new roommate will be. <laughs> so this is it guys, this is a new tank. 24 inches tall, 18 wide by 4 foot. Please tell me what you think. I'll respond to all messages. So if you won't like it, please like and subscribe. Leave a message. Tell me what you think of Bobo. That's his name. He's just had a feed, so... As you can see, he's very lively. Beautiful fish. I accept that his new roommate plays up, doesn't play up should I say, <laughs> or should I say I hope this guy doesn't mess him up, because from what I've heard these guys can get pretty violent, and his roommate has had a lot of time to live with fish, so he's not actually a very aggressive fish, so if it doesn't work out it'll be because of this fella and not the new guy, but stay tuned, see what happens, oh, oh, Thanks for watching guys, please like and subscribe for more fishy videos, bye!